Hello everyone, my name is Terra Nova, and today we are playing The Sims 4 Animal Crossing Challenge. Sorry, I forgot what I was playing for a second. Um, <laughs> This is episode 2, and I'm really excited because this is the episode where we actually get to start doing something with the challenge. And as you can see, Jackie is pretty excited too. She's sitting comfortably at the end of her bed, and she is ready to start this day off. All of her needs are filled up. And she's perfectly fine, and it's a little after 9 in the morning in the sim world. And, yeah, sorry, I said and a lot right there. But, um, if you haven't seen the first episode of this challenge, um, I was just going over and checking that out because I go over all of the rules and what our main goals are. And if you'll remember, we have to make a bunch of friends, we have to throw a bunch of parties, and we have to basically complete the museum by finding almost every one of the collectibles in the game. We have to find all of the trophies, all of the metals and crystals and elements, all of the postcards and fossils, the microscope prints, the space prints, um, the space rocks, the fish, and yeah, I think that's it. The geodes. And those can only be found in the alien world. I don't know about those. Those were added to the game after the challenge was originally created, so we'll see. But if we want to go for 110% completion of the museum, we have to find every space object and every type of plant, as well as every painting, um, a masterpiece painting of every style, and all of the frogs. So thankfully we don't have to find the frogs right away because some of those are really hard to find. But I think one of the easiest things for us to do is to start by looking for a pen pal. A pen pal. <laughs> pen pal. And she wants to catch a fish. She wants to admire art, which we have none. And she wants to meet someone new. Buy a TV. You can't afford a TV. Um, I know she can actually afford a TV, but until we find roommates to move into the two houses next door, we are the sole source of income, and uh, I want her to devote her time to uh, looking for collectibles for the museum. So that would not be very possible if we were, you know, going to work every day. But now that she's done that, I'm going to have her come and dig these up while I look around for people for her to meet. Um, I know there's more over here. Oh, there's one. And I know we don't need to find every frog right away, um, but I'm going to have her look for them just because we can breed them and make a bit of money that way. Ooh, Nina Caliente. Can you introduce yourself to her? Because I really like her hair. Um, yeah, we'll just see. We'll see how this goes. My plan for today is to just kind of focus on Jackie and fulfilling some of her wants, getting to know her. Um, trying to find a few pen pals and making a few acquaintances because we do need 15 friends and we need friends to throw the parties and we need to get a gold level in every party or gold status in every party. So we'll just, we'll just start with the basic building blocks, um, and building a couple of our skills and meeting a few people. And just getting a couple of things and then I think in the next episode um, or whenever we start getting enough things to actually put in the museum we'll start paying for new floors and walls and lights and doors for in there um, I'm hoping we can do that in the next episode but we're really gonna have to see how things go so it looks like she met someone she wants to make a friend who are you? Nancy Landgrab, you are going to be our friend. We're going to brighten your day. We're going to enthuse about the outdoors. And we are going to give you a compliment because she's... Let's look at her. Let's look at her before I compliment her. She's pretty. She needs some help with the makeup. But that could just be my graphics. Yay, Jackie's now. Or, uh, skill. She was just bored and now she's flirty. I don't know if I want to marry Nancy Landgrab. 
We can get married in the game, and I'm completely open to whatever kind of style marriage or just not getting married that happens to happen for Jackie, but I'm pretty sure Nancy is married already, and yep, spouse Joffrey, Joffrey. and I'm not, I'm not going to break up marriages to find someone in this game. It's just not life. something I want to do. She wants to buy a hot tub. Are you two friends yet? You guys are getting on really, really well. Why don't you discuss interests? And tell a funny story and express admiration. I'm going to ask her about a career. Let's see what she does. I don't think we know. No, we don't. I don't know. Ricks. What are you doing right now? Just chatting? Let's make this go a little faster. I just want them to be friends. It'd be really cool to have... Yep. We have a friend on the first day of the challenge. How cool is that? She's a criminal at Mob Wives. A criminal at Mob Wives. Okay, you don't want to be friends with someone like that, Jackie. Your needs are still really good, so I'm going to have you... Orientate myself for a second. I'm gonna have you come over here and check out this thing and this frog thing and then I'm gonna have you Go fishing Because she wants to catch a fish and we need to catch every fish for the museum So we might as well start working on those skills I'm just speeding this up because um, I personally don't enjoy just grinding for items and collectibles the entire time and I don't know if you guys really like just watching me do the same thing over and over because it's going to be a lot of repetitiveness trying to find those things for the museum so I'm just going to skip past those for now and try to focus really on her friends and her friendships and just get things moving a little faster so that's something in the Animal Crossing games too. Um, they kind of start out a little slow, so you really get enough money to start upgrading your own house and buying all the fun items. And Jackie already has a fully furnished house, so we don't have to worry about that. Um, let's see here. She wants to tell a joke. She wants to buy a hot tub, and she wants to cloud gaze with Nancy. No. We found Tetra. That's kind of funny. Okay, so one of my friends um, has neon tetras. Um, they're super tiny little fish that are all these bright neon colors and they glow in the dark with a black light. It's really cool. Ah. Um, they come in all different colors like pink and green and blue and orange. It doesn't look like this game's tetras are very colorful. They're just little green and white. Anyways, got off on a little tangent. And I have to apologize. I'm really sorry if you can hear my cats in the background. I had to close them out of my computer room because they were all over the desk and all over in front of the computer and making it really difficult. Um, so now they're very upset and crying outside the door. So if you can hear that, I apologize. But if you can't, I guess I'm apologizing for nothing. Okay, so she's really hungry. Um... As soon as she gains that skill, I'm going to have her come over here and eat a serving of hot dogs made by Summer Holiday. Who's Summer? I don't know. Sims 4 Sims by name Summer. Okay. And then when she's done, maybe go to the bathroom. Okay. Speed that up a little bit. And then we'll go use the facilities. And then it's getting kind of late, so I think I'll have her come back here and... No, actually... She wants to tell a joke. And I really like her hair. So I'm going to have her do a funny introduction. Quickly before she moves away. <laughs> and then I'm gonna see if we can do a joke. Friendly. Oh, what did I pick? Chat. 
Okay. We can chat. Uh, joke about monkeys. We be that one too. She's a stay at home mom. That is so cute. I love that. I want to be a stay at home mom one day. I think I'd, be, I'd get too frustrated. Being stuck at home all the time, doing the cleaning. I don't know. Okay, so she got the joke. She wants to dance to stereo music and find a collectible. I think we found all of the collectibles on this lot for today. Um, do we have a bit of money? I'm gonna buy our stereo real quick. That's something cheap that we can do. Um, there, here we go. We'll just get our the cheap one. The Kaboom box. Put it right there. And might as well. Might as well get. Here's a cheap one. We might as well get a hot tub. Um, I know can't really afford it right now, but I think it's pretty cool that they have those in the game now. They were just recently added in a stuff pack, and we might be able to use the hot tub for like our parties that we have to throw. So we'll speed through that. Come on. While you're in here, why don't you <laughs> yep. check for pen pal replies? Oh. <laughs> and then find another pen pal. Oh! We've got a new matey from Barnacle Bay. Matey. Yo ho. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Alright, so hopefully we can get another pen pal soon, and I think mm, write a letter to Barnacle Bay. Write a letter to our new matey. Maybe we can get our first postcard from there. Kind of fun to already start getting those. And I'm going to have her set the color to the teal, same as her hair, and I'm going to have her get in the hot tub. Actually, before you do that, Turn on to backyard and dance to that stereo. We bought it just so you could dance to it. Oh wow. Okay, let's take a look at this. Let's watch her awesome dance moves. They were cooler before I tried to move the camera, but this is fine too. That satisfied her wish or aspiration or whatever they're called in The Sims 4. Can I just say I really like how the music in this game is all colorful and coming out of the stereo. I know they've done that for past Sims games, but I feel, I don't know, I'm just, I'm feeling the colors in this one. Alright, Jackie, why don't you get in this hot tub that I just bought for you. It was a butt ton of money. And enjoy this a little bit. Uh -huh. Alright, let's let's see how this looks. That is so cool. Alright, I'm gonna get a quick picture. Jackie's first day in the challenge and her first hot tub experience. Alone, of course, but that's not important. <laughs> that's not important. She worked hard today, she made a friend. She found a bunch of stuff. We can send some of this off. And we can get a fossil out of there and open up our time capsule and breed our frogs. Look at that. Now we have two of these and I can sell one for 35 simoleons. That wasn't a very expensive frog, but we officially made money. So that's cool. I like how she just did all of that in the hot tub. She didn't even get out. She sent things in the mail and she opened a box and... Hilariously tiny T-Rex arms. I want to take a look at these. Oh. Okay. And we got the caveman. I don't know his name. 
gunk. That's cool. That's really cool. But she's going to bed now. Okay, let's speed through this because nighttime is kind of boring. A little bit. Oh, why is she awake already? No way is she. Oh. Oh. My bad. Turn off that radio. And go back to sleep. Now she's going to be glued to that hot tub. It's like the rocking chairs in The Sims 3. Every Sim wants to be on them all the time, no matter what. Give them a free moment and some free will and they go on there. That's okay though. Alright, so she's really uncomfortable. But really all she needs is a shower. So we'll give her a thoughtful shower. And we'll have some breakfast. How about scrambled eggs? And she wants to collect a new crystal. She wants to get to know Nancy. I'm going to unpin that and we'll just see if we can find her. I'm not really interested in inviting her over today just because I want to see if we can make some more acquaintances because we really don't know that many people. And we only have like a positive relationship with two. And that's not even, that barely counts right there with Sharon. That's a super tiny little relationship. So I'm hoping we can make some new acquaintances today and have enough, um, know enough people to hopefully throw a party soon. Maybe we'll throw a party to celebrate us adding doors and floors and lights to the museum. I think that's a cool idea. We're gonna need a lot of simoleons for that though. She wants to go to the museum and, and admire art. Maybe we can do that. Be kind of fun to get off the lot today. Maybe meet some different people. So she's literally just standing at the counter and eating. <laughs> That's kind of boring. How about you, Jackie, go and check for pen pal replies? Oh. Ouch. Sorry. I just scratched my face and I hit my arm on my desk. It's got like a two layer shelf thing, so. Don't want you to play an instrument. I don't want you to read that book. I don't want you to buy an instrument. I want you to put that away and purchase books. And we are going to get... What are we going to get? I know what I'm looking for. We're going to get some fishing books. Um, because I know there are only so many fish you can catch when you're certain levels. And I don't want to just keep repeatedly catching the same fish waiting for her to gain levels. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Sorry. I'm trying to figure out what I'm doing next in the game and talking at the same time. And I struggle with that sometimes. So I'm just going to have her quick go to the bathroom. And while she's doing that, I'm going to have her collect these things quick. And I'm just going to speed through this, and then we will go to the museum, travel to the museum, yeah. and then we'll have her travel to the museum and see if we can meet some people, maybe some guys. She found a fire opal, that's pretty cool. Where are you, Jackie? Alright, we're going to speed through this really fast. She dug up a time capsule, too. And a diamond. Okay. okay, so for her... Um... Lifetime Witch, I really want to complete it. I know it's not necessary for the challenge rules, but it's necessary for my own goals and rules. <laughs> I really hate doing a challenge and not finishing that. I really hate playing in general and not finishing that. Okay, so she ate some of the eggs and then put them down. No wonder she's hungry already. Come on, Jackie. Come eat your breakfast that you made. You slaved over that. Okay. So this is why I got this little table, chair, bench thing at the end of the bed. Um, Because since it's just Jackie for now, she really doesn't need a whole table and chairs. She can just sit there and eat her food. And it just kind of saves space. 
Um, if she does get married and have children in the future, we will have to change that, obviously. At least only two people can sit on their maximum. But I guess someone can sit in this chair. I'm not sure yet. I'm just not sure. I'm going to take this stereo away, away from her, though, if she doesn't keep it turned off. Find a pen pal, and then we're going to travel. We're going to go to the museum, because that is what she wants to do. And we're going to see how a museum is supposed to look, and maybe get some pointers for our museum. Municipal muses. <laughs> Sorry, I had to take another sip of my pop. Alright, so she posted on the pen pal forums. Let's see who we can find around here. I really like her outfit, so let's go talk to her. Friendly introduction, and that's Alice Spencer Kim. And then this guy has cool glasses, so let's friendly introduction him. Mr. Lewis McNeil. What do you want to do now? You want to talk about dreams. Well, maybe we can talk about our dreams with Lewis. <laughs> Mr. Lewis. Let's speed this up a little. All they do is sit there. I want you to talk with each other and engage in conversation. And you're just sitting there. Okay, stop chatting with Alice. Can you give her a friendly introduction? Are you broken? Go here. Um. Okay, here we go. All right, let's go find Lewis again. How do we go? Okay. There he is. Friendly introduction with him. Oh, look at. Sharon and Ryland Sanders and Donnell. Donnell. I don't know. Jackie, you moved so slow. Okay. She wants to play an instrument. I'm not going to let her learn on an instrument. I think it's a waste of time for her right now. And I'm not going to let her cook. And, uh, we can do that. Let's admire I like this one let's admire that one okay it's them that's causing this because they are all stuck admiring the paintings I guess okay here we go so she's admiring the painting how beautiful it is the colors they use how does it make you feel emotionally? Yep. I don't know. I'm not an art critic. Oh cool, they have an easel here that you can actually paint with too. That'd be a pain in the butt in real life if you have to go all the way to the museum just to paint. And if you didn't finish, you had to leave it there. Uh -huh. Oh, awful. Huh. Alright, so that's cool. Is there anyone? Let's go um, friendly introduction with him. What's his name? Ryland. Don't know what happened there. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about my camera work. Um, he's kind of cool looking. He's a teenager though. Mm, not much we can do with a teenager. Why don't you, Jackie, come out here and look for collectibles? So here's a thing. Dig. Look for frogs. And then maybe we can fish for a little bit. See what kind of fish we have in this side of the river. Okay, you can stop talking to him. You can stop talking to that young man right now. Right. So we'll have her do that. And then maybe... Oh, look at There's a bunch of people out here. A bunch of kids. Mm, I don't think there's really anything else that we can find for collectibles over here. Oh, I was wrong. 
Dig for that, and then... Hmm. How many... How many friends does she have? Okay. Well, she met one person today. <laughs> we made a lot more progress yesterday, but that happens. Um, she did catch a fish, so I'm gonna have her stop doing that. Oh, and she caught a guppy. That's a new fish for the museum. Alright, so we're making progress at least, even though we're not making as many friends. I want you to come over here and talk to Beatrix. <laughs> Beatrix waiting. She's gonna be a friend. She's in a flirty mood. This might go to our benefit. When we first met Nancy, she got in a flirty mood and we were friends just like that. I guess that's not her style. Who's this? Jay Huntington the third? Why don't you do a friendly introduction with him? Maybe we can have him move in and be one of our neighbors and then he can pay for all of our bills. Why don't you get to know him? Give him a compliment. Brighten his day. Ask him about his career. That's so weird. You walk up to someone and then you stand right next to them facing like not even facing each other, that's awkward. Jay is happy. Well, that's good. I'm happy for you, Jay. I know Jay Huntington III has kind of a bad reputation, but I think it'd be cool for Jackie and him to be friends. Maybe Jackie can be that one girl that just kind of, she's the friend that tames them down a little bit. What a jerk he's being sometimes. I don't know. Bruhana that, yeah, that's Cassandra. Bruhana. Well, actually, they're growing up pretty quickly. Tell him an engaging story. Hey. Hey. I don't know. That's funny. I'm amused by Simlish. Rinka. Seneca Bisbub Plo. Alright, so express admiration. Ooh, who are you? Fiona Richie? She's dressed all fancy. Maybe? Were they on a date? That'd be so awkward. Oh, not what I wanted to do. Okay, just Christmas girl. I was just curious as to what that was about, but I think they're still acquaintances. They're almost friends. Why aren't you asking about his day? Yeah. Give him another compliment. And, okay, now they're friends. Now we officially have two friends. And I'm gonna send her home because she is tired and hungry and really needs to use the bathroom. So. Okay, that was a successful trip to the museum. <laughs> um. So yeah, I want you guys, if you are watching this, to let me know just what you think of this challenge so far, and um, let me know your opinion on the game Sims 4 and Animal Crossing. Personally, I have always been a fan of both of these games, and so I'm really excited to do this challenge because it combines two of the games that I really love. So I don't know. Just let me know. Talk about it amongst yourselves in the comments. And I'll forget the mail. And then I think I'm gonna send her to bed quite soon. Um, my timer is about to go off in another minute or two. So I think as soon as she goes to bed. Oh, yep, okay. So I'm gonna end it here. Um this is the this has been the second episode of the Sims 4 Animal Crossing challenge. And if you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Um my name is Terranova and I hope you all have an absolutely fantastic day.